At the end of the summer, most people are squeezing in extra trips to the beach, back to school shopping, and last minute getaways. While half of the city is trying to relax at Rockaway Beach, the dedicated men and women in the New York Department of Buildings Special Operations Unit have spent a good part of the year inspecting every single public school and UPK facility in the city to make sure they're safe when kids return. You might guess that conducting an inspection of the city's 3,300 plus school and UPK sites is a full-time job, but it's just a fraction of what Special Operations does. The team's responsibilities include sign enforcement, padlock closure orders, ADA compliance, citywide sidewalk shed sweeps, hazardous reinspections, inspecting homeless shelters, three quarter houses, reported adult establishments, and privately owned public spaces. At first glance, these duties seem unrelated, but combined, these tasks help the DOB continue its most basic and important goal keeping New Yorkers safe. Maybe you called 311 to report an illegal commercial business operating out of a residence down the street. If you did, then the special operations team was dispatched. And if none of this excites you, just think about all the work special operations does with our law enforcement partners, like the NYPD's Organized Crime Control Bureau and the Office of the Medicaid Inspector General. Anytime these agencies conduct sweeps of properties associated with cases, members of our special operations unit are standing with them at the scene. So if you're a New Yorker or just visiting, your safety is our business. This is the work of the Special Operations Unit.